Ever pondered how important it is to save for education expenses? Let's unravel the mystery of the 529 plan, an ingenious tax advantage savings vehicle tailored for education expenses. Originally, the 529 plan was confined to post-secondary education. However, it has evolved, expanding its coverage to K-12 education and apprenticeship programs. The SECURE Act of 2019 and SECURE 2.0 of 2022 even extended its reach to student loan repayment and funding a Roth IRA. There are two distinctive types of 529 plans. First, we have the education savings plans, which grow tax deferred. The withdrawals from these are tax-free, provided they're used for qualified education expenses. On the other hand, we have prepaid tuition plans. These allow you to pay current tuition rates for future attendance at designated colleges. Now that you have a basic understanding of a 529 plan, let's delve deeper into its benefits. So, what makes a 529 plan a preferred choice for many when it comes to saving for education, you might ask? There are quite a few reasons, and we're about to delve into them. First, let's consider the tax advantages. A 529 plan, you see, grows tax deferred. What this means is that the earnings on your contributions aren't taxed while they remain in the account. And when it's time to pay those hefty tuition fees, you can withdraw from your 529 plan tax-free as long as the funds are used for qualified education expenses. That's quite a perk, wouldn't you agree? Now let's take a moment to talk about prepaid tuition plans, another type of 529 plan. With these, you can pay current tuition rates for future attendance at designated colleges. Just imagine today's prices for tomorrow's education. In a world where tuition fees seem to rocket skyward with each passing year, the ability to lock in current rates is truly a boon. But the allure of 529 plans doesn't end there. Did you know that you have the ability to transfer your 529 plan once per year or change beneficiaries? Flexibility is the name of the game here, and it's certainly a game changer. And let's not forget about the expanded usage of these funds. Thanks to recent changes in legislation, 529 plans aren't just for traditional education expenses anymore. Now they can be used for apprenticeship programs and even student loan repayment. It's a broadening of horizons, a sign that 529 plans are evolving to meet the diverse needs of today's learners. While it's clear that a 529 plan offers numerous benefits, Let's not forget that every coin has two sides. So as we continue, we'll also shed light on some potential limitations and drawbacks of these plans. Stay tuned for that. It's crucial to understand the limitations of a 529 plan before you decide it's the right fit for your education savings strategy. Let's start with prepaid tuition plans, a type of 529 plan. They allow you to pay current tuition rates for future attendance at designated colleges. Sounds good, right? However, they come with certain restrictions. First and foremost, these plans do not cover room and board, an essential part of many students' education expenses. Moreover, there may be limitations on eligible colleges which can restrict your educational choices. Now let's talk about withdrawals. You can withdraw funds from a 529 plan tax-free as long as they are used for qualified education expenses. However, if you use the funds for non-qualified expenses, brace yourself for taxes and potential penalties. This can serve as a deterrent for those who might need to access their savings for emergencies or other non-education related expenses. And of course, there are fees to consider. Like many investment plans, 529 plans can come with maintenance fees. These are the costs associated with managing your account. Additionally, depending on your investment strategy, there may be other fees related to your investments. These costs can chip away at your savings and reduce the overall return on your investment. Knowledge of these limitations allows you to make an informed decision about whether a 529 plan suits your needs. With the changing landscape of education and finance, what does the future look like for 529 plans? Well, it appears to be a future full of flexibility and adaptability. With the passing of the SECURE Act, the scope of 529 plan withdrawals has broadened significantly. Now, not only can these funds be used for post-secondary education, but they can also cover apprenticeship programs, offering a viable path for those seeking hands-on training in various trades. In addition, the Act allows the funds to be used for student loan repayments, providing a much-needed relief for those grappling with student debt. 
But the adaptations don't stop there. Come 2024, a new feature will be introduced to the 529 plan. If there are unspent funds remaining in the plan, they can be transferred to a Roth IRA. This not only offers an additional tax advantage, but also provides a head start on retirement savings. And what if there are leftover funds in a 529 plan? Well, there are several options available. You can change the beneficiary, keep the account for future education needs, pay off student loans or cash out, though the latter may incur taxes and penalties. As you can see, 529 plans are becoming increasingly flexible, adapting to the evolving needs of students and families.